Elon Musk, the new owner of Twitter, has flown to New York after spending much of last week at the social media company's San Francisco headquarters, Credit. Elon Musk and a group of his advisors have tightened their grip over Twitter, meeting with company executives to work on layoffs, ordering up product changes, talking with advertisers and reviewing content moderation policies, according to more than a dozen current and former employees involved in the efforts. The priorities for the world's richest man and his advisors at Twitter are twofold, five of the people said, they are working on how to trim the company's ranks while also exploring a slew of changes to Twitter's mobile app. For now, the timing and scope of layoffs remains fluid as lists of the top and lower performers at the company are finalized, the people said. Mr. Musk's advisors have also assigned a team of Twitter's engineers to work on its verification program, the system that doles out badges to high-profile or notable users to confirm their profile's authenticity. Twitter could charge users $20 a month to retain their verified status, two people with knowledge of the discussion said. Mr. Musk, 51, flew to New York on Sunday after spending much of last week at Twitter's headquarters in San Francisco, according to one person familiar with his movements and a Twitter account that tracks the location of his private jet. Some of his trusted confidants remain in San Francisco, the people said, including David Sachs, a venture capitalist, and Sriram Krishnan, a former Twitter product leader and partner at the investment firm Andreessen Horowitz, which invested in Mr. Musk's buyout of Twitter.